Jan Yeager is, amongst other things, a friendship coach. Yes, she is from America, and yes, you can hire someone to coach you in the art of friendship. But she's also a doctor of sociology and an expert on relationships, and she's just written a book called When Friendship Hurts. She studied friendships for 25 years, and when I talked to her earlier today, I asked what we actually expect from friends. A lot of people expect things we should expect to be trustworthy, to be honest, but they also expect that the friend's going to drop everything and be there for them no matter what, forgetting that the friend has a job, has a family, has obligations, so that can be unrealistic. What are the warning signs that are friendships heading towards the rocks? Well, the first sign is that when the phone rings or when you get an email, you don't jump to answer it or read it. You may want to have a discussion. I'm a friendship coach in addition to a researcher and writer, and I've What's actually... a friendship coach? Well, it's someone who helps friends to understand what's going wrong, but I've actually salvaged some friendships because it truly was a misunderstanding. You hear this phrase now, friends with benefits. Which right. I think, basically, you sleep with your friends, I think. is the Well, by definition, a friend with benefit is no longer a friend. It's gotten into another category. Some people, it does work out. A lot of exes who become friends. But if it's a current, ongoing romantic relationship, it really is more than just a platonic friendship. Should you go into business with a friend? Well, it, once again, it depends on the personalities. Uh, there are people that they actually have found their friendship strengthened through the business, uh, and others where it, it was a cataclysmic type of thing. So it's important to say, can we survive if the business doesn't? Have an exit plan from the get-go. And finally, the worst kind of friend? The risk taker who literally puts you or your family or other friends and themselves in harm's way and you might not survive that friendship. So that's a real red flag. Jan Yeager, thank you very much for your time. Thank you.